Hi everyone. Um, I wanted to quickly share my mini for June. This is for the GGS Club, the Girls Gone Scrappy. Great fun name. And it was um, set up by Marion at a piece of craft, piece of craft .com. Um Anyway, so quickly I just wanted to share my mini because there's some techniques in here that I learned from the GGS girls just by simply going onto their blogs and, and looking at their work and, and they have great techniques, great suggestions. Um, so I'm really learning a lot, so thanks. So I just wanted to go over quickly um, some of the stuff. This is basic gray paper. This is what inspired me um, for the album. This little blue birdie is um, so super cute. This says Joy is here. And um, I'm not really good at remembering product names. Prima, I don't know. Um, sorry, bear with me. This is the first inside cover, or inside page, and it says Love Out Loud, Love the Same. And um, just a big sticker there. And place for journaling, a little tag that I just covered with black. And here is the next page. It's actually an envelope pocket card. This pocket card um, is an envelope card that I learned how to make from Marion. She did a tutorial on these and she made it into a little mini. I'm super cute, easy to make, and um, love. I love making these because they're just that's fun and simple, easy for me. So thanks, Marion. Here's the back of that. And here's the next page. I'm going to quickly go through this. This says Tickle. There's a little blue birdie again. Love it. So cute. So you can put a picture there, some journaling, whatever. And here's the next page. This one says Create. I'm trying to get it centered in there. Sorry, guys. There we go. Um, that was fun to make. Really colorful. And here's the next page. This one right here, this is actual chipboard that I got from Joanne's, the bear chipboard. And I just covered it with that basic gray paper. I love it how it turned out. It's really simple and, and cute. So, and I stuck a brad through it and, and really neat. Here's the next page. This right here, I actually learned from Mary and how to do. She had the tutorial on her alphas. And um, I used it. And it, it's really fun, easy to do. I also did some embossing on the back of this flower. Um, I didn't really like that it didn't cover the entire thing, but it, it turned out okay because now it looks like splashes of water on the back side of a flower. Let me see if I can get close there. Anyway, there we go. So sometimes mistakes turn out to be good ones, and I think that was a good one for me. And here's the next page with a little bit of embossing here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and post pics, so um, sorry about this video. I'm being jumpy and all over the place. And here's the next page. This one was um, super simple and it just says imagine. And the next one, a little small tag for some journaling or whatever with this flower. And the back side of it says smile with a little bumblebee. Super cute. And this is the last page. And this one says play. Always have to play. Life is fun, so let's play. Here's the end. This is the back. And it just says the end. I know it's kind of cheesy, but I had that sticker on it. That was super cute, and it's subtle. So, And here is some more embossing that I did. Um, and it turned out pretty neat. I like that embossing technique that Marion showed me. And it says with a grin. So anyways, um, thanks guys for um, sharing all your techniques and everything on your blog. I'm, I'm really learning, and I'm having a good time. And our club is super great. All the girls at GGS. Um, are really fabulous. I'm looking forward to seeing all their minis and all the new projects that we have coming up. So thanks, Marion. Bye.